In this video today, we're going to show you how to set the battery level status of your iTrack Caravan Angel or AT1 Asset Tracker tracking device. So from the home page on your iTrack Live account, you want to go over to the left hand side to the object panel and then where you've got your object, if you click the action button, which is the three vertical dots to the right hand side of your object and click edit. After that a new window will appear and now you want to be clicking the sensors tab. Now click the plus icon in the bottom left corner to add a new sensor and give the sensor a name. So for this example we're going to call it battery level. In the type drop down menu select battery and in the parameter drop down, you need to scroll down and select IO67. And for the unit of measurement, we're going to put V for volts. And then we need to enter a formula in the formula box because the tracker will give a value of the voltage multiplied by 1000. So we need to reverse this by typing the formula X divided by 1000. We can click the arrow here to get the current result and you'll see that the tracker is returning a value of 7.3 volts. So now we can click save, close the window and now if you refresh the browser and then click your object in the object panel then you'll see in the data panel on the bottom here we've now got the battery level of the tracker at 7.3 volts. Now when the battery level goes below 6.5 volts that's the time when you need to think about changing the battery. So what we can do now is create an event so that you can be alerted should the battery level go or when the battery level goes below 6.5 volts. So to create the event we need to go to the top here and click the settings button in the top left corner Again, a new window will open and then we need to click the events tab. Then to add a new event, we click the plus icon in the bottom left corner. Now we give the event a name. So here we'll type low battery. And then from the type drop down menu, we need to scroll down and select sensor. Then we need to click, uh, select the object. So we need to select Caravan Angel. And then in the parameters and sensors section on the right hand side of the window, we need to select battery level from the first drop down menu. This is the sensor that we've just created in the previous step. And then the middle drop down, we select the less than icon or symbol. And in the value box, we simply type 6.5 and then finally we click the plus button to add it here and now we need to select the notifications tab and we can select system message push notification sound alert and message to email so when the battery does go below 6.5 volts and you're logged into your iTrack Live account, you'll see a system message appear within the software. You'll receive a push notification if you're using an Android device via the app. There'll be a sound alert through the software. And then you can also receive an email to the email address you put in here. You can use more than one email address. You just need to make sure that each email is separated by a comma. So once you've done this, you can click save and close the window and that's the end of the process so now you can see the current battery level and then when that battery level goes below 6.5 volts you'll be alerted via a text uh, via an email and then at which point you know you need to start thinking about changing the battery in your device okay i hope you found this video useful 
Have a great day.